Joining us today after her 6-4-6-3 win over Jeannie Bouchard, looking as healthy as ever, Cece Bell. Cece, great job on the win. How'd you feel about your performance? Thanks. Yeah, I felt really good. Like you said, healthy, which is uh, the most important thing right now. Game's getting better every match, and yeah, I'm just really excited to be here. Mm -hmm. And after yesterday's match, and not to bring that up, but you know, up 5-4, serving for the match, not able to close that out. Mm -hmm. Did it feel good today to get to close it out with a break of serve as well? Yeah, for sure, for sure. You know, like I said, I've not had many matches in the last couple of years uh, from injuries, so it's good to just get as many sets in as I can here, and you know, I'm getting more comfortable each one that I play, so yeah, I'm just really happy to be here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you looked great out there, and you know, for you in this time period, obviously the last three months, no tennis even available to be played. How, you know, how frustrating was that for you, particularly given you had just started your return back to pro action? Yeah, that was really tough, because uh, in Australia, I was, you know, gaining momentum and getting more used to it, and then, you know, coronavirus happened, but none of us obviously saw this coming, so there's nothing we could control, so I just tried to get in as much practice as I could during this time, but obviously it's not the same as matches, so it's great that they're holding this event, and uh, hopefully there's more to come. Yeah, and we were actually here in, uh, for the 100K event mm -hmm. in February, and I think you were here on that yeah. first day. I remember there's a big buzz. CC Bells is in the building, <laughs> uh, and then of course I think you pulled out just yeah. to maintain your health. How mm -hmm. has you know this three-month period again? Ha have you been able to get fully healthy? Has that helped at all? Yeah, um, you know, not playing tournaments has actually helped me for sure during this time. Uh, so we've uh, had kind of a running joke that maybe it's helped, you know, me and a couple of people like maybe <laughs> Federer during this time. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, no, it's been good. I, I started off, you know, not playing as much, just getting my arm healthy. And then uh, the last couple of months I've been training full, full time. Yeah, no, mm -hmm. and again, your tennis continues to look better and better. And for you to come here, uh, is it more just about getting that match play experience as opposed to winning or losing? Yeah, for sure. We're only focused on getting matches in right now because that's what, you know, we feel like I need because I've been, you know, drilling so much, practicing so much. So. Uh, getting tournament-like match play is huge for me right now. Mm -hmm. Was it hard not to burn out while training over these past three months? I'm sure the incentive is, you know, just go, go, go. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, it's definitely tough, but, um, you know, like I said, I was kind of slower to start in the beginning, and then once I kind of built it up, I was I was ready to go. Mm -hmm. No, that's awesome, Tier. Well, for you, again, you had this long layoff from professional tennis, and I'm sure you learned a lot about yourself then, but, you know, over these th last three months being quarantine, uh, mm -hmm. any fun things, any new hobbies for CeCe Bellis? Um, I've been cooking a lot. That's been a huge thing for I've me. I've seen some photos. It looks good. <laughs> yeah, cooking has been a big part of uh, quarantine for me, along with practicing, obviously. But, uh, yeah, I picked that up even more than I used to, so it's been fun. No, I'm glad to hear mm -hmm. that. And for you, again, how much are you missing, I suppose, pro tennis, pro action being out on tour? So much. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> I think, you know, everyone really is at this point. We miss it so much. So we're really excited that the U.S. Open's go and hopefully, you know, Cincinnati, a couple other tournaments. So we're really excited. Mm -hmm. And for you on that note, again, because it's still a couple of months away. But yeah. right now, as things are, U.S. Open is played. CeCe Bellis is going to play. Yeah, I'm going to play. Okay, mm -hmm. that's awesome. You're comfortable yeah. getting back out there? I am. I'm comfortable. Right, that's <laughs> good to hear. How have you felt about the communication in general? Just Has it been difficult, frustrating to follow everything along, or are you feeling pretty good? Um, I've been trying not to follow it too much, <laughs> okay. and I know like a lot of players have concerns, and I totally understand where they're coming from because you know right now cases are you know obviously spiking a lot, but I'm really hoping that it goes down at that point so we all feel safe enough to play. And I think if we all get tested and we're all fine, then there's no stopping us for sure. Yeah, no, and we are all looking forward to that. All right, mm -hmm. last two fun ones for you. Again, uh, it's always fun to play these sorts of exhibition events. It's a more intimate setting than for, uh, than usual. Uh, let's say you know the a, uh, the WTA calls and they say, CC, this is who you're stuck with for the rest of the year and you have to pick one player in this event Ooh. to coach you for the oh. next year on tour who are you picking and why one player in this event one player in this oh event. um wow that's a great question i would choose jamie Loeb because <laughs> she's one of my very good friends i think we'd have a lot of fun i think she would choose me too <laughs> <laughs> that's if you interview her from I a tennis perspective would it be like in one year out the other you're like i got this <laughs> i don't know i think she's she's got some good uh tips for sure I think it'd be pretty fun mm -hmm. well then my last question for you again we are here at the top seed club in Kentucky and just curious what your thoughts have been on this facility and again getting back to playing competitive matches this week oh my god this facility is amazing the indoors is so nice in I was Nicholasville where oh are my we? gosh I know and <laughs> even the outdoor courts. I remember when we came in February we were so blown away by how nice the courts are inside and then getting to see the ones outside now it's, it's incredible mm -hmm. I feel like that Jeannie Bouchard kick serve though got up there it like did it, it, it was bounced. bouncy out I there know. yeah I, I don't remember that as much from uh, the indoor courts, but I definitely feel it's bouncier outside yeah, here. Yeah. Well, again, your level of play continues to get better and better <laughs> this weekend, so congratulations to thank you, you. CC, and Appreciate thank it. you for joining us in the Crack yeah, Rackets thank booth. Thank you.